Welcome back to Fud's Play Sue Golden 4. This is episode 9 of my Let's Play. And last time we left off, we left off having killed off our three companions. Well, I think they're anyway. Let's poke them. Ow. Okay, not dead. How is everyone? Dead. Ouch. Where are we? So she's not dead either. Uh, hopefully, Chipu. I wouldn't mind staying in a desert island with just two girls. Meow. Oh. It, it's my bright. It's my bright. It's too bright, it's bright. Let us investigate the area before the sun sets. I'm gonna die first, anyway. Let's get another shade. I'm hungry. Let's have a quick check this island then. It's what like most places for base. I wonder if there's anything on the island though. I assume not, since it's apparently deserted, but... There's a bird, which I just scared away. Nothing else around here. What about up this pathway here? I need to get this pathway. So it's a turtle. Can we eat with turtle? Actually, I better not. I better be careful how I say that. It might end up being an ally. <coughs> or a boss, maybe. Um, just, I haven't heard turtles have been bosses in the games before. And Dead Forest and the hill? It is a hill of that. Any, any enemies on the hill or anything else? It doesn't appear to be. It seems to be a relatively safe place which you can destroy YouTube frame rates. This is horrible grass texture. You can really see how the game's dated a bit. Ooh, necklace. Uh, can I give it to one of the girls? No. I have to, do, we get to, have to give it to a cat. Oh well. I just wish to be anything else up here. And back through a dense forest. Any woodland things or any chests in the wood which I missed? Doesn't appear to be. Unless I missed anything on the corner there. Nope. This really is beginning to look like a deserted tropical island, at least. You know it's tropical because it's got the uh, steel drums in the background. Whereas, well, as tropical as steel drums are, I can't hear them without thinking of my old music classes because I was school I went to used to have a little steel band. So, I, all I can picture is just school kids uh, with sticks with elastic bands around them tapping on some old tin drums. Nothing in that uh, shady area, I think. So I'm out in the cave. Cutscene? No, just music. Uh, nothing appears to be down here. Except a big yellow line. And more cave. And people say Sweet Code and Four's uh, dungeons are complicated. Actually, scratch that, nobody says that. Sweet Four has not a huge amount many dungeons, but the dungeons it does have are generally straight lines. Which put Final Fantasy XIII to shame. With a mysterious, uh, scary green glow. Not too scary green glow. Um, nothing seems to go there. Anything else going on? Well, I was just supposed to explore everything. There's nowhere else for me to go, so hopefully, when I get back, there'll be a cutscene waiting for me. More 
more cave. All the cave, all the time, everywhere. Say, this place, it is a deserted island. No way! I don't want to shrivel up and die in a place like this! We'll have to escape then. We're staying here. Just sound pretty good. As long as you keep it to yourself, Chipu. Need food now! Azo, what do we do now? I'm in charge of collecting food! Um. Oh, well, you seem to be good on trees, so you can cut down trees. Mm, I'll make some rope. And you go coconuts. Kind of appropriate, really. So I need to find rope. Um. Hey, are we selling crab out here? Oh, you're selling items. Not even any butt bargains. Typical. Uh, but I will take another Jesus clock just in case. You never know when you're going to um, need to resurrect someone. What's this stuff about? Is this just a uh, bl glitch? Uh, no, it's rope. That's my job done. Where do I need where do I hand them in? Or should I You know what? I'm gonna see what's down my cave again. I'm on my own. Hopefully it's a safe trip down to the cave. I can't imagine it wasn't fights last time, so it shouldn't be fights this time. He says. But going down here last time I actually carried on the game on. There are fights. Surely. I'm on my own as well, aren't I? Because I left a party. I'm fighting a giant bat. It dealt damage to me. No, I dealt damage to it. Let's try that again, shall we? Another 10 damage? Ouch. Oh, well, it's dead. That's me fine. Well, I can probably heal myself down here, so it's probably a good place to go training. Maybe it's a timed thing, maybe if I go speak to him, I'll be done. But I'll start this journey now, so I might as well carry it on. If we stop there, I'll heal up and come back. And now we have crabs. Well, crab. Keep a close eye on my hit points. Unless I do that. <coughs> More bats. Don't seem to be doing much to me, though. A mermaid, or is that just a girl in very um, skin tight short um, trousers? Well, she's left something on the ground, whatever she's done. What is it? A lucky ring. Oh, here, look. Lucky ring. What's this lucky ring about? An increase of luck. Bit of fortune, eh? I'm guessing that was maybe a cutscene. There's a mysterious water girl there. I'm going to call her a mermaid just because I think that's what she was meant to be. <coughs> I 
One thing which I have found myself surprising is we've been playing a lot of Sukoden and 4 recently. Um, obviously, I'm playing it right now. You know that because you're watching me. Um, but I'm not actually finished uploading. I'm not finished releasing all my Sukoden 3 episodes just yet. And I'm already nine episodes into this. In terms of, I want to know when I'm recording this. Uh, today's the 27th of April. By my calculations, I think an episode's going up tomorrow. I'll have a quick check and see which one it's going to be. That one is episode uh, 95 is going up tomorrow. Uh, actually, we uploaded that one a week ago. So I've I've actually played quite a lot of Sukoden in the last fortnight. But I suppose I'm in my mood for it because I completed uh, Su3 uh, last... Mm, yeah, I think I did it on Saturday night. Uh, so I'm already a good few hours into this. As I said earlier on, it's not my favourite Sukoden game. It's probably my least favourite of the main five. <coughs> That's not to say it's a bad game. It's like saying... Eating a ham and cheese toasted sandwich is not my favourite meal. I'll happily eat it, it's very nice. But, offer me a bacon, lettuce and cheese sandwich and I'll eat that even happier. Yeah, recording this early is going to let me record a lot more stuff in the next uh, few weeks or so as well. I hope we get ahead when the uh, big games rush comes in the next uh, few weeks or so. Oh, we'll cut to you maybe. Uh, no. Hmm, it's time to eat soon. Apparently, Chipu is joining the party, whatever happening. So I'm guessing I've got to go collect the other girls now. I think one of the girls is up here, one of the old girls up the other path. Oh, here she is. Laszlo, I have safely completed a task. Thank you. I'm assuming you want to collect some coconuts over here. I'll use you around here, Joel. Yep. Hey, Laszlo. Everything's A-OK -okay over here. And that bird who flew away is now flying away again. I'm going to save my game at this point. That's probably a good point to say, I reckon. Not going to be an episode just yet, don't worry. <clears throat> I'll say don't worry, if you want short episodes, let me know and I'll try and do that for you. But the only place I've not been this island is up Green Hill and around the corner here, which looks to be where we're setting up camp. Yep, yeah, I'll rest for today. Why not? and get off this island already. I have no reason to believe that you are lying. That's right. We both talked it over and decided Lazo's that we'll prove stunned. your innocence no matter what it takes. We've got lots of work ahead of us. Mm, yeah, thank you, everybody. Indeed we do. Good, good idea. Ah, uh, you can thank us later. Let's just get some sleep for tomorrow. 
I'm in charge of collecting food. Cheap food's a food expert. Um, hey, Joel, you can cut down trees this time. Oh, I'll collect coconuts. I actually missed a click there, but I, I wanted to collect coconuts anyway. What is the matter, Laszlo? I'm still making good progress. You seem to have more to do. So I need to collect coconuts, but... Is he still saying the same crap as always, or has he actually restocked? If he's restocked, I'll be surprised, because how often do you restock on an island? Uh, no, no restock. Just... A cat on an island. So, we have these coconuts over here. Yep, there's one. Um, there's another one. There's the third one. That's my job done. Should we go and see if that uh, girl's there again? Since she seems to be still doing her work. If are you still doing your work? As though, I want to get better myself. Yeah, she's still doing her work, I assume. Jules doing the same, and he's just going to try and flog me for some crap. So let's, um, let's try and visit uh, Mermaid again. Whoever she is. Apologise if you can hear some noise. I think my neighbours are being a little bit noisy tonight. If I can hear in my headphones, I'm definitely being noisy. I don't know if you can pick it up because this microphone shouldn't be picking up from behind. But it's beginning to annoy me a lot. <coughs> I, mean, I could use magic against it, but why bother? Whatever's well, happening, Maslow's leveling up a little bit. Which is interesting because the other two, the other three characters aren't leveling up. I could do a bit of training with them, but no, actually I can't because I. Oh yeah, I could go training. Sub training lake. Oh, she's there again. She's a little bit uh, less scared this time. Thank you. Nice of her. She wants me to have a shiny. I assume she's pointing down rather than at anything in particular. Or anything of particular. So what should you leave? A water amulet. Because magic plants and water resistance. Yeah, I'll take that. Okay, I'm assuming we're just going to go back and collect our party members again and... Sleep again because it doesn't seem unless there's another cutscene. Okay. Since we don't want to run out of pots on this place. Three crabs. I'll tell you what, I'm actually going to ruin them this time. Dancing flames, why not? Since I'm 
should be resting up in a moment unless something interesting happens. Uh, me versus a crab. Easy fight, really. <coughs> I mean, I healed up my hit points last night, so. Imagine just being a bit on health as well. <coughs> yep, there's the entrance way. In all, it's um, just white, non coloured glory. I suppose you're coming out of a cave, so it should be blocked right and hard to see out of. Hmm, it's time to eat soon. Oh, you should know, you got the food. Um, I'll get you next. Laszlo, I've safely completed a task. Again. Oh, there's a muff lying around in my room. Only a tiny little midgy one. Laszlo, everything's A-OK -okay over here. So, yep, back in sleep. So, this is a repeat of day one, just with a different um, accessory. So, I guess tomorrow, if we do the same thing, I'm going to try and chop down trees. I'll send... Yeah, we already did different tasks on day three, I think. If we do that again. Yep, mess with today. Wondering, what was Troy doing there? Gaian and Kuluk do not get along. It should come as no surprise to see the worst become of that. If that's true, it could be bad news for everyone. Jewel, are you worried Jewel about Snow? Snow? Sitting in a tree. Wh why are you bringing w him up now? W -H -I -N if I offended you, I apologize. Well, not race, uh. Um, no, you don't have Jordi's. to apologize. She's got that weird little symbol on her forehead. So she's. She might be of a different race. Okay. So. Um, I'll cut down trees. Paula. Here, Jewel, mate, rope. And. Paula's on coconuts, too, too. And I'm also on next episode, due to because that's about it for this time. Join me again next time when we collect wood. Bye-bye.